hello everybody welcome to my channel this is Ravi and I am going to explain you today SAS topic 44 that is part 2 of real time a complete SAS code for a BDA structure related ADAM data set we have already seen the part 1 in the previous video SAS topic 43 and this was the continuation of that video so you can see here the code here we have seen some of our parameters we already seen in the first video and this is second video I'm going to show you how to write the coding for the deriving the aval aval c aval units and param cds and param param n and adt atm and adtm and ady variables see here how to you know uh, derive this aval variable we have an a variable in case of vital sense we can find the standard variable vs strsc in case of laboratory you can find the lb strsc in case of ecg you can find the ecg e standard after conversion of the raw values we have a standard values present in the sgtm data set of the particular variable so if they contain some special characters so we can exclude those special characters and assign the numeric version of the values to aval and character version of the particular aval is called aval c sometimes it is a you know uh, some laboratory analysis something related to normal or abnormal related things we can assign the character results to aval c otherwise the numeric version if it is a number related things for example if they collected in systolic bp or diastolic bp values the contain any special character we can exclude the special character and assign that particular numeric version variable values to aval okay here yeah, this is a part that coding otherwise we can directly assign if they don't contain does not contain any special characters just directly assign the standard values to aval and units to aval units and value to aval value so here directly we can assign the param to vs test cd the test cds and tests were assigned to this param and param cds but here there is a difference between the param and param uh, vs test is nothing but we should if any units are are any special uh, related uh, like you know if whether it is a sitting posture or any like you know here you can see this one like position or location any specification related variables presented the qualifier variables presented along with the test series we can concatenate with the vs test and forming the parameter this is the important question what is the difference between the test series and analysis data parameters they are along with the units or position or location any qualifying variables are present along with the test we can concatenate forming the param otherwise we can directly assign the param to vs test okay and here uh, we are applying some param numbers as per the mock shell or as per the statistician we will give the one numbering to the each and every parameters okay so here you can see this is the aval this is the aval c and this is the units and this is the param here you can see param containing test cd and units test cd and units this is the numbering we are giving as per the cells or as per the statistics suggestions okay and here this one the param definition so parameter is nothing but along with the test present in the sgtm we can sorry we can uh giving concatenate with the location or specification or position etc qualifying variables okay and here what is the ADT what is the ATM what is the ADTM ADT nothing but analysis date and ATM is analysis time ADTM is analysis date and time if it is a complete date present in the VSGTC directly we can giving the ADT to this one otherwise we'll we are going to impute the values okay these are the analysis purpose so we are not imputing anything in the sgtm level as per the statistician imputations method we are creating the adt or adtm or adtm variable to you know find out the duration or further calculation if it is a complete date we can directly convert the values to numeric version okay see here you can see 
VSDTC if it is a complete here this is a complete date so we can directly the time part this is a date part and this is a date and time part if it is a partial date for example the first row you can see there is no time part so the only date part present and ATM is missing and ADTM also missing because ADTM is populated only in case of the complete date is there in the VSDTC then only we can populate so remaining partial dates we are going to see the imputation method how to impute the missing time part or date part or month part etc things we'll look into the further videos okay so here you can see if it is a partial date we need to divide each and everything okay so the time parts and date part year part everything we need to divide into three parts and hours minutes and seconds as well as we are going to uh, divide the treatment dates also whether it is a treatment date or uh, subject visit date they mentioned in the SAP document if the date is missing in the vital signs where we can uh, pull out the date from either SV data set or treatment start date etc they will mention in the SAP document so as per that one we take the data set uh, and will replace the date to this missing date here you can see and if we are going to impute any date part the flag is D if we are replacing the month and day we are putting the month so we are putting the only uh, year part so if we are replacing the year month date so the flag is Y in case of you are replacing the only seconds the flag is S if we are replacing the minutes and seconds the flag is M if you are replacing the hours minutes and seconds so the flag is H and here the uh, ADY is nothing but ADT minus treatment start date plus one okay so here you can see we are splitting everything into year part month part day part and hours minutes seconds so when we are replacing the particular variable the treatment start date year month and if it is containing the hours minutes seconds that is also we can divide into these many variables if the any month is missing we have to replace the month available in the treatment so that variable we are going to replace into this date here you can see in the first black color so there is no time part here but we are replacing the 00, 0 with ATM okay so here also you can see the arrow mark only year is present year year month date is present where we have taken this one here you can see SVSTDTN subject visit date so 25th August we are replacing okay so here 25th August 2009 2009 we are taking from this one and 25th August we are taking from the SV date okay so in this way they will mention the rules and regulation where we have to pick up the values and the coding part just splitting all the date time and hours minutes seconds etc variables into different different variables and where there is a missing then we can replace the available date for the particular uh, variable what mentioned in the SAP document okay so continue please continue uh, watching the further videos so I'll upload more and more videos on the Adam BDS further variable derivations and if you want to really learn the real-time projects I'm going to uh, taking the sessions I'm giving the trainings so that is a 28 day training so if you want to enroll my training so you can contact the below numbers that is 28 days Monday to Friday I'll provide the project related videos books and etc thing in the real-time sessions I'll write the code in front of you how to derive the variables and how to write the coding HDTM, MADAM, TLFs real-time project I am going to explain in front of you that is a 28 to 30 days course if you want to really enroll if you want to learn more and more interesting topics so you can enroll and you can contact the below numbers so I am the trainer I am going to give you the training so thanks for watching, watching this video if you want more and more interesting topics please enroll please subscribe my channel and please enroll great online training thank you